Oh, don't mind Wei. He is just here setting up the cameras uh, for the house. It's all very big brother. Just pretend like he's not even here. Oh, okay, yeah. sure. Thank you so much for meeting me today. I know you must be very busy. Oh no, it's my pleasure. It's really nice to meet you. Nice to meet, oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank this you. is Zola, my associate. Sure. Um, why don't you tell us what's going on? Mm -hmm. Okay, um, well I just started dating again and I'm using match.com and I just filled out all the questionnaires and I checked all my likes and my dislikes and stuff like that. And let's just say that the results have been strange. Strange how? Well, last night I was supposed to meet this guy named Hardball at the snake pit. Hardball? Oh. I'm sorry, Hardball? Oh yeah, um, actually this, this is Hardball. <laughs> Whoa. I mean, whoa. It's um, cute. What can I say? Yeah. The heart wants what the heart wants. But anyway, that is not who showed up. This is who showed up. His name is Stanley, and he is a lawyer. Oh, he looks nice. He looks Scottish. I really like his tie. I. <laughs> You're kidding me, right? You're not into the suit-wearing lawyer type, are you? No, no I'm not. The thing is, this is not the first time this has happened. Anytime I go to set up a date with a guy that I might like, some weird, boring guy shows up instead. God, it's so hard to meet a guy anyway these days. I mean, but how did you meet your, your boyfriend? What's his name? Fallon? Hey, B. Uh... Oh. Does this pizza taste, like, good? Oh, God, that smells like feet! Throw it out! I, uh, I just got lucky, I guess. <sighs> okay, but the weird thing about all of this is that the guys that are showing up on these dates are exactly the kind of guys that my mom would set me up with. Oh, that's not paranormal. Just. Call your mother and tell her to stop hacking into your Match.com account. Boom. Well, that's actually the problem. Um, my mom died three years ago. Oh, Jolie, I am so sorry. No, thank you. I know, I know. It's a fine, though, you know, because I've gotten over it. I guess I just need my mom to get over it, too. Can you help me? I, I think so. Okay. Why don't you... Log into your Match.com account on your computer, and we'll take a look. Okay, there you see. Date set up all week with Hardball and Spike and Axel. Everything right. looks fine. Yeah, this all looks good. Let's see what happens when we set you up for the date with somebody really sketchy. Interesting. Who's the most interesting guy here? Okay. Here we go, Jim the Bone Crusher Johnson. He is a UFC fighter and he looks pretty intense. Ooh, he is very cute. <gasps> oh. I'm sorry, Jolie's mom? Um, you have to let Jolie go. But she needs to make better choices. Look at her. Mom! Mom, I I love you and I really miss you. But you have got to move on. A leopard print never goes out of style. It does. Uh, but seriously, you have to find your own afterlife. Head towards the light. Oh. Is it over? Is that it? Um yeah. I think so. I think your match.com is no longer haunted. Oh my god, thank you so, Ooh. so much. This has been really easy, actually. Well, I really, really appreciate it, but I gotta go because I have to meet Axel at the cave in just a couple hours. So, bye. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank Good you. Good luck. And I'll send you my bill. It was weird. Oh, <laughs> but it was kind of nice. I mean, Jolie's ghost mom clearly just wants to look after her. It's sweet.
B, can you get me a burrito? I'm not feeling so great after that pizza. Great. 